Good afternoon. Right, I thought we'd do a, a kind of repair one. Um, we obviously know the problem. I mean, these machines boot up regardless, but we know. I'm gonna say it's real three. I've already, I've already swapped the looms over. You can easily do that on this machine. Yeah, I might as well show you because I know some people are interested, others in, but I sure. Right, okay, there you go. There's real three, <laughs> there's real two. Easy to swap them over just like that. Okay. So now real two and three. Ah. Doesn't affect the machine at all with these doing the looms like that. The temp in. See? Still the same. So I know for a fact that reel is at fault. Okay? So it doesn't even re it won't it won't recognise we know we know that. So now we've established that. I mean it's a it's a, it's a pretty you know common thing to do. So I'll swap them back just to make so I mean, it's not that difficult anyway, so it tells you what on there. Yeah. I mean, real deal before the... Uh... So, yeah, they're back in their normal positions now. Um, and then I'll just show you. See what... So, I'll just try it again. I always do this, because, you know, you know, disturbing connections. Right, OK, no... Well, basically, the reel is made up of these have actually been made by a good friend of mine. These have been made, and they did them a long time ago now. I've, I've had these for ages. So it's either going to be one of them, the chip on it, as you can see. Well, it's missing, but it's, it's either going to be that. Or these things, these have been made as well. Yeah, a mate of mine made these a few years ago, so they're sort of spare. The, like, the, uh, the ones with the white plugs have been made. They're, they're the originals. They've already been obviously changed out. Probably out, might have been out, I don't know. And then what I do is when I change one of these out, I've also got some of the gates. See the gates there? So this is what we're on about with repairs. I don't know whether you can see them through the bag, but they're the little the little H gates. I, I, I'm assuming they're called that them. They're basically them. That's what goes. Because obviously they create a field and the tab goes through it and the machine knows what the position of the reel is. So what I should do, the one I swap out of reel three, then I shall keep that separate from these because I know these are all working well. I think they are, yeah, they are. They're probably, I think they've been replaced. I think they've had new gates, them ones. Then I should go off to my mate because he's much more, because I mean, bloody hell, look at the size of them. There's four, there's eight. He's much better at those. So he'll change the gates for me. So, right, I'll, I'll do that and then I'll be back. I will join these videos up, so that's kind of part one. Unfortunately, being real free is always the pain in the arse one. So you've got to get these off. Similar to MPS, real deck clips. There's three of them, I don't know where the third one is, it's there somewhere. Because that's the feather I'm going to change. Yeah, I'm going to change that. I mean, the, the, you could change them kind of from the back, really. Well, sort of. <laughs> sort of. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to change. So, there you go. Okay, part three kind of thing. I've put the real deck back in. I haven't tried it. But there's the offending... That's the one, yep. They say it's the offending part. Took that out. Well, I think it is. It's them. I'm pretty sure it's them gates. So I'll put that upside down, like I say. And I've showed before, I know. I've got new gates. New ones, you can buy them. So this is the kind of component level repairs that you need to do, really, when you to keep old machines running. Because you can't always, like I say, these have been remade. I've not needed these yet, but I bought these just in case. It was a good mate who made them. Some of you will know him. Some of you definitely know him. But yeah, they're, they're handy to have. They're, they're handy. I've not needed one yet. He's even put the LED lights on them. 
but definitely these so I've got three more there and I've got I'm guessing these two probably are bad ones as well probably out of another machine I know I had a phase of these going down at one time <laughs> so anyway Nice and loud, isn't it, with the back door open? <coughs> there you go. One more. You could ever... <laughs> I guess that all these real sensors must talk to each other because one goes down and it doesn't recognise the numbers of any... Uh... But there you go. I thought I'd share that with you. People do ask me. and I know not everyone's interested, but people do ask me. So there you go. I mean, I don't know if, uh, if you didn't watch the video of this machine last night, you actually see the thing going down. Although it's been, it's been going down and up for ages, it's like been playing okay for a bit and then going down... <clears throat> Then I've switched the machine off and thought, oh, I'll do that another day. Then when I've come to switch the machine back on again, it's worked. <clears throat> but it actually didn't work so as you see. So that's, uh, I was nearly said JPM then. Belfruit Real Sensors on Black Box. Later Black Box. So there you go, folks. Hope you enjoyed that.